What's up guys and welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel and did you know that there's actually additional anti-aliasing setting in Fortnite which you need to disable since it actually decreases your FPS so much here since the latest Fortnite update and don't be worried guys I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it and it's super super easy and trust me afterwards you're gonna have way more stable FPS because this anti-aliasing feature isn't even listed in the Fortnite settings themselves so therefore you have to disable it in the game config but don't be worried guys as mentioned I'm gonna show you everything and if you guys enjoyed this video please don't forget to leave a like and without any further ado, let's get straight into this topic. Yeah guys, now I'm going to show you how you can disable this anti-aliasing mode and all you got to do is go into your Windows search bar, type in presenter, temp presenter, open up the first file, then we're actually going to drag this here, uh, click onto local, press F on our keyboard for Fortnite game, save, config, Windows client, and there we have our game user settings. But before we change anything guys, please make sure that the attribute read only is unchecked. Then we're going to open it up and I'm going to put one comment already down in the video description guys. What you got to do is go here onto edit, you know, go onto find and type in Ford anti-aliasing guys, just like that. And you're going to insta find it here now in your game user settings. And there you should see now Ford anti-aliasing method and please put it on the disable guys. This is super, super important and temporary super resolution quality on performance guys. Both of these settings are super important that you can get like more stable FPS here in Fortnite and just simply make sure to put the first one here on disabled and the second one on performance. It's literally that easy. For most of you guys, it should actually be on like true or enabled or whatever like the other thing was. But yeah, you gotta make sure that it's set on disabled guys. Super, super important. Then you're gonna go here onto file again, save it, close it now. Right click onto your game user settings, go into properties and put the check here back under the attribute read only so that you don't change it by accident anymore, you know, while launching like Fortnite and changing some settings. And as mentioned, you can only change the setting here in your game user settings. It's not a weighable in-game. So therefore you gotta do it here guys, that's just simply how it is. And I hope that this was helpful. And yeah guys, with that said, this is it for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel on the Spot Up Mode. Thank you so much. And if you still have any more questions, feel free to ask me them down in the comment section below. I try to answer as many as possible. And with that said, have a great day, have a great night whenever you're watching this. And until next time, stay awesome. I'm out. Peace.